looking for that great mid-sized cruisers? Then come with me for a quick walk around tour on Barcabella. She's a 2005 3470 cruisers by Cruisers Yachts. She's very well powered with twin 8.1 engines, has a full enclosure, generator, air conditioning, lots of features, including an LLI, ladies like it, lounge pad up front. Now we've seen Barcabella before. This is the third time I've had her on the market. And the reason being is because she's such a great boat, all the owners sell her and move up to a 40 footer. So come with me for a quick tour on Barcabella 2022. Let's go. Here we are starting off forward starboard on Barcabella. This gives us a view of her nice rounded lines. Moving forward, we see we've got a nice covered windlass right there, spotlight, and our anchors there. Coming down along port side, this gives us a view. We've got some heavy duty cleats right there, stainless steel port lights, nice rail all the way around and there's what I call a, an LLI ladies like it feature a large four deck sun pad that they can enjoy the day on coming down along the side we see we've got a paddle board holder right there and this gives us a view of the radar and the antennas on top of the radar arch coming down along the side Nice feature on this boat, it's of the vintage where they still used curved Taylor tinted windshields, gives the vessel a nice sleek look. We also have wing windows right here which open to allow air into the cockpit. Coming down along the side we see on the radar arch we do have a handle so in theory we can walk around. Here we have our cruiser's yacht's badge right there and an additional pop-up cleat to make tying off that much easier. Here at the transom, we see we have an extended swim platform, nicely covered with the plastic, plastic tech deck right there. We have a covered boarding ladder right up under that hatch it's four steps to make boarding that much easier. Stepping aboard, we see we have trunk storage, a grab rail, a place for our fenders right there, and a gotta love it feature. There's an in-deck mount there so you can add your barbecue or cocktail table or whatever. This is a great area. Just put a couple deck chairs here and enjoy the view. We enter the vessel through this port side door. Notice we have our wash down right here, and then we have a hot and cold shower there. Now the enclosure on this vessel has, is within the past two years, so you can see it's nice and clear. Immediately upon entering the vessel, we have a nice U-shaped seating with storage underneath. We have an additional speaker there. Got to have music. Now that table is removable for more space or it can be lowered and you can make a sun pad out of it. Right here, we have our wet bar. And the refrigerator on that is about four and a half, five years old. Got to have some power. So there's our 110 outlets. We step up two steps in this vessel and immediately to port, we have another LLI, ladies like it feature, a four and a half facing chaise seat. As we circle around, we see our gray deck right there 
is covered with carpet for non-skid and just to protect the condition of the dash. To starboard, we have our double wide helm seat right here with storage underneath. Nice thing about that is you have room for a companion. Here at the helm, we have our C80 Raymarine radar GPS unit. Below we have the hard rocker switches, so they're easy to maintain. They're nice and clean. Tilt steering, and then all of our gauges are right there, right in front of us with a great line of sight. Our VHF radio is off to one side. And then this gives us an overview of the cockpit right there. The view from the helm gives us a nice line of sight and then access to the foredeck is up these molded steps. We've got a solid grab rail right there. Up, up, and out nice and easy. We enter the cabin through this offset sliding door and immediately in front of us, we see we've got some steps with a nice handrail right there. Our galley is off to port. Nice feature of that is it's cut out so you can see out into the cockpit and through the salon. Cruisers Yachts does an excellent job. They do a nice upgraded wood cabinets with Corian countertop. And Corian backsplash, you can see they've extended it up the whole way. We've got a microwave, dual burner electric stove, stainless steel sink with a sprayer. Down below, we've got built in cabinets for lots of storage room. The interior is marine grade vinyl, like an ultra leather. As we move forward, notice we have a solid wood door there. Now here's one of the best features on this boat. It's a big selling point. We've got a vacuum flush head. We have a very large facility here, mirrored locker above, formed in fiberglass throughout, and something you very rarely see on this size vessel, a separate molded in shower with a seat. That definitely is a feature everyone likes. Now as we move forward to the main cabin, we see we have our berth right there, double wide. It's over seven feet long. And to help us get in, we've got a couple steps, which you'll appreciate at some point. Notice we've got a flat screen TV, wood cabinetry all throughout the gunnels, very nice and rich, and we have our hanging locker right here which is cedar lined. There's also a privacy curtain, and we have a mattress here, not just a piece of foam. Now, as we circle around, we see we've got our flat screen TV on a swivel arm more storage coming down along the side we have our gunnel cabinets right there and our u-shaped dinette which also can be converted to a sleeping area our power panel is right here we have our 12 volt system 120 volt system generator start and controls we also have a tank indicator for fresh water and then a nice clarion stereo system right there we have our air conditioning thermostat right there and as we move aft we have another hanging locker for our guests this area back here is full beam You've got about 
four feet of headroom, so there's more than enough room to sit. This can be converted into a sleeper also, and we currently have a nice table. Again, solid wood set up. That gives us a peek in the corner right there. And here we are, we have a nice view forward. Arcabella is neat, clean, has been well loved. Viewer today, owner tomorrow at South Mountain Yachts.